What if I told you that you could create Hollywood style videos and animations without cameras, actors, or expensive software? Sounds impossible, right? Well, it's not. And that's where LTX Studio comes in. This tool lets you turn simple text prompts into full cinematic videos, complete with scripts, characters, camera shots, and even dialogue. And in this video, I'm going to show you step-by-step -step how to go from an idea to a finished short film using nothing but LTX Studio. By the end, you'll know exactly how to direct your own AI-powered film. Let's get started. So what exactly is LTX Studio? In short, it's an AI-powered filmmaking tool that transforms your ideas into cinematic videos. Unlike most AI video generators that only create short random clips, LTX Studio actually lets you tell a story from beginning to end. Here's what makes it stand out. You don't just type a prompt and hope for the best. You get full scene-by-scene -scene control. You can design characters, adjust camera angles, direct lighting, even edit dialogue, all inside one platform. It's like being the director of your own movie without needing a crew. Getting started with LTX Studio is super simple. Just head over to ltxstudio.com and sign up with your email. Check the description for all the links. You'll be redirected to this page where you have to accept their terms of service. Once you're in, you'll land on the dashboard. And this is where the magic begins. Right up front, you'll see options to start a new project. On the left-hand side, you'll find your different ways of starting a project. You can create a new storyboard, a new timeline. You can head straight to video generation or image generation. They now have VO3 and Nano Banana integrated as well. Lastly, you have this option down here where you can train for a professional actor, which ensures you get character consistency. What I really like is how clean and organized everything is. You're not overwhelmed with dozens of menus. The dashboard guides you step by step. So whether you're a beginner or a seasoned creator, you'll feel right at home. All right, let's dive in and create our first project so you can see how it all works in real time. I'll click on the new storyboard button. We get the option to create with the help of AI or start with a blank storyboard. I'll opt for AI assistance, but first let's rename our project. This helps us stay organized. Here we have the script editor. This is where your story comes to life. You can type in your own script, paste one you've already written, or even just start with a short idea and let LTX Studio expand it into a full cinematic script for you. For example, I'll type, a young warrior discovers a hidden power while battling in a neon lit Tokyo alley. In seconds, LTX transforms that into a complete manga style scene with detailed action, atmosphere, and even character interactions. You also have these optional settings. Let's start with the special requests. Here's where you can get creative. Want 80s retro vibes, a rival character, a dramatic training arc, even a giant mecha battle? Just write it here and LTX will weave it into your story. Format tells the AI how to structure the final project. Short film works if you want a tight three to five minute anime short. Commercial is great if you're making an anime style ad for a product. And if you're experimenting, keep it on custom. If you want full control, you can even describe your own format. For example, anime episode three acts with opening and cliffhanger ending. The AI will follow that structure. Genre defines the overall style. You can choose drama, romance, cyberpunk, fantasy, or even horror. This instantly shifts the way your story is written from action-packed battles to slow burn emotional arcs. Tone sets the mood. If you pick dark and dramatic, it'll feel like a big anime showdown. Lighthearted and funny gives you more of a slice of life or comedy anime vibe. You can experiment with these until the story matches your vision. Together, these settings are like your anime director's toolkit. They make sure your story doesn't just look animated. It feels like a real anime episode crafted for your audience. These are the two stories generated. Read through them and see if you find one you like. You can always generate more by clicking on generate more right here. I already like the second story more, so I'll choose that and click on next. This loads to the setting and casting page where we get to design our cast embers. My story has two characters, Hiro and Sora. As you can see, the studio automatically generated the characters for me. However, my story is an anime and the images generated are cinematic and realistic. Let's fix that in the setting on our right side. 
First choose your preferred aspect ratio, I'll leave mine as 16 by 9. Next on the video style, I'll scroll all the way down and choose anime. Wait for it to regenerate. You can also edit the images in the platform and even choose a different voice or custom, create your own unique voice for your characters. If you don't like what you got, you can also upload an image in your preferred style as a reference. In this cinema inspiration prompt, I'll choose Wuxia, which is the Chinese martial arts cinema category. Click on next and we get this breakdown of each scene. Here we can edit the scenes we wanna change by clicking on the edit button. Want to extend the story? Just click add scene and type what you'd like to happen next. Don't need a scene, just delete it. This flexibility gives you full control over pacing and flow. Once satisfied, click on start. Here's where LTX Studio really separates itself from other AI video tools. Instead of giving you just one long block of video, it automatically breaks your story into individual scenes and shots, just like a real anime storyboard. This is our first block of the storyline. We can click on edit in gen space to open this panel where we get to edit the image even further. My image generator of choice is Flux, but as I had previously stated, they have Nano Banana integrated, which you can use as well. I'll opt to create a video instead. Since I like the images I got, I'll click on the three buttons here and send to timeline all the images and videos I plan on using. On your gen page, simply drag your image to the timeline, add a prompt and choose the generative tool you want. They have different options to choose from. I recommend VEO3 if you're making realistic and cinematic short films. Once all your videos have been generated, they'll appear under assets and you can simply drag them to the timeline. You can edit your video in the editor. It's not as advanced as other editors, so I prefer to polish my final edit in DaVinci or CapCut. Click here to download your video. Resolution options go from 720p for quick previews, 1080p for high quality uploads, all the way up to 4K if you want that cinematic crispness. The default file format is MP4, making it super easy to upload directly to any platform without extra conversion. So where does LTX Studio really shine? If you run a faceless YouTube channel, this is a game changer you can pump out consistent story-driven content without showing your face. Want to make short films or cinematic trailers? The scene-by-scene -scene control is perfect for that. Marketers can use it for ad creatives that look polished without needing an agency. And educators, imagine breaking down lessons with anime-style storytelling. Students would eat that up. And that's it. From a single prompt to a fully fleshed out cinematic short film, all inside LTX Studio. If this tutorial helped, make sure to like the video, subscribe for more AI tutorials, and drop a comment telling me what kind of short film you'd create in LTX Studio. I've left the link to the platform down in the description if you want to try it for yourself. Until next time, keep creating and I'll see you in the next tutorial.